Alafu pole kwa hii lakini watu wanga kujua Rais ameitisha ngombe ngapi ndugu yangu Ladies and gentlemen Eric Omondi hapa President of Comedy Africa Yo yo this is Kushman Pedi wa magengi Mamba vipi watu wangu wa Nairobi na Kenya mzima Subscribe kwa stories za nini 254 Across all social media platforms Hapana kuchanga nya Na uwe ndo dori Subscribe right now Finya sahi Sa wewe finya Amjamo kwa wale watu ambao mnatazama tuko na Jalango TV, tuko na Nairobi 254 TV, tuko na Kaka TV na tuko na Story za 254 TV. Na basi tuko jijini Nairobi, langu jina ni Jitabi Suleiman kwenye hafla ya injili, ngoma za injili. Na basi tumekutana na Idadi Owen, msanii amazing tena sana. Dede wewe unajua nimekuwa nimekuwa nikisikiza ngoma zako kutoka nikiwa mdogo tena sana. Unamshamini mzee? Like <laughs> <laughs> uh -huh. by, by that it shows you that I've been very consistent. Yeah, now God I'm quite faithful in my life because you know to very few ones are consistent at that level. Yeah. For all these years doing the same thing, yeah. now God banana blessed to the next level. Yeah. yeah. Talking about this event so far, Unona Jimekwa Jinona do my sweat Jamani. I'm still sweating. Nimiroka said Sai Sai, Rock Biga Show Fiti Sana and I thank God for that. Nimoka show fiti sana and I thank God for the ministry that City Letters are doing. Because at the end of the day we need to promote the gospel music and we need to do ministry because ministry nile unapakwa street ku preach as you hear right now when fanya altar call. The people who came here, maybe they're not born again and this is an opportunity for them to give their lives to Christ. Kuna maswali mengi ambayo nauliza pole kwenye mitandao ya kijamii. Being a gospel artist, lazima uokoke. Must you follow the ministry and staff? Yeah, yeah. No, for me I believe you must be born again because you out of uh, out of the abundance of the heart the mouth speaketh so whatever it's in you what forms you is what you need to bring forth so i believe you can't talk about something you don't know yeah yeah number so mko kufanya mziki wa injili amazing tena sana manzi big up congratulations what keeps you moving ecosystemsi hakuna tonga wapi for me it's just to know why i'm doing it i know why i'm doing the ministry and that's what in an propel to the next level because at the end of the day whether music in a hit ama hit mimi nafanya muziki whether kuna pesa ama kuna pesa nafanya muziki whether jina ende juu ama sende juu mimi nafanya muziki because by the time i started i didn't have money i didn't have any name i didn't have any fame and god and 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 to that level so even today i'll still praise the name of the lord no matter what yeah so far sasa hii umekuwa kwenye gospel industry for a long time yeah unaweza compare gospel industry sasa hii na the way back how is it tofauting again kuna so many transitions because being there for for that long it shows you that after a while there are transitions in so many things mm -hmm. and whenever there's a transition there's always a ka issue flani because what before I adapt something new because I remember even us when we were starting yeah. we were the first artist kuja kwa stage as a single artist because yeah. before sit kuingia gospel artist would kwalamo in a choir munge yimba kama single artist yeah. so but time we adapt to us to understand how we are doing it as a single artist it was very hard yeah. but eventually people adapted yeah. Yeah. so far kuna wale wasanii wengi wa gospel wanasema kwamba wanataka usaidizi kutoka kwake daddy owen na kutoka kwake guardian angel have you done anything so far kwa upcoming artist Mimi and Mugoba for many years. Yes. My track record speaks for itself. If yeah. someone can go back and, and, and look at how many, how many artists I've raised yes. through the generations, ni wengi sana. So even till today, I'm still raising. And you see, raising artists, Imanisha Lazimo in the Nile studio for the collab album sign. There are so many ways and so many ways you can help someone to grow in the music industry. Ata kama uko at the back seat, but you can still help me. Tumano basu kufanya charity organization na Charlie Nruto, is that a way of bringing, doing back to the society? Kusaidia... Mini kona, mini kona foundation yangu, nito Malaika Disability Foundation. Malaika. And Malaika, I started at Malaika 2012. So I've been doing charity since 2012. So people who know my record, they understand that I've been helping person living with disability for so many years. Yeah. Yeah. Na bado uko sawa. Mimi foundation. Is it right for a gospel artist kutoboa masikio na kuweka earrings? Labda labda tuwaita wale wametoboa na masikio tuwaulize because you see na wewe kama minister wa gospel maybe unaweza advise to kuna generation ina kampia na ina duka pon nyinyi wenye mlianza. I always say sometimes that things is just more of how you depict yourself. Vinyo na jibeba ndo mnyoto kubeba. So at the end of the day kama nikitoa una feel in your heart inakusaidia kufanya vitu vingine then well and good but if you feel that it's not right whatever you are doing to be honest because i don't think there's a kuna vitu vingine kwa hii dunia god alitupatia the wisdom for us to understand what is wrong and what, what is right because bible iko na so many things it may clear in between but kuna zingine zimeachwa for our wisdom you understand for our wisdom to clarify alafu 
pole kwa hii lakini watu wanataka kujua rais ameitisha ngombe ngapi ndugu yangu juma <laughs> I'll I'll not, not, I'll not, I'll not discuss I'll not discuss anything eh, I'll not discuss anything that it involves someone else who is not here yeah. is not right yeah. so when it comes to that matter I plead the fifth yeah. eh, ask so me a letter sana ah, yeah. tunamalizia basi <laughs> tunamalizia kidogo tu event hapa hivi ime ime organized by a church lakini sasa watu walikuwa wanajiuliza maswali mbona gospel artist msikuje pamoja mu create your own concert ambayo inaweza wasanii wote wanaweza kuja wa gospel mm. uh, it's not as easy as we think because yeah. all of us have uh, different visions yeah. so sometimes putting all these visions together is not as easy because mm. the same thing what would uh, when it comes to gospel artists in Angola, they are very harsh because they are gospel artists who come here But I've never had anyone asking secular artists who come here to do something. So yeah, understand. <laughs> so I always say people are always very harsh to gospel artists, and uh, I know too much is given, much is expected. Yeah. I believe our unity will be unified and will be shown this year. This year, I'm gonna a lot of unity from the gospel artists because me last time in Lefanya, that they went tour in a festival in Eldoret. Like all the gospel artists came to support me. Yeah. When Moji does his show, people support. Juzi uh, Garden and Kwana Fanya Lunch, Jackie Palace and Kara, like all the gospel artists were there. So we always show support when it comes to our projects as gospel artists. Right, Basi, talk to your fans. So I'm making to Moja Pala. This year, guys, you just expect a lot. First and foremost, uh, my music. I'll be releasing music and an album. Follow. So guys, manze, go watch that video. It's on YouTube. Uh, apart from that, we're doing more with, with my foundation. I'm doing my like disability work on March 9th. So guys, come and support. Twitter, we are And then at the same time, I'm pushing so much to help persons living with disability this year. Yeah. Thank you so much for your time. God bless you all. Thank you so much.